Hello everyone and welcome to finally my room tour. I finally got my room clean enough to show you guys. A bunch of you have asked me to do a room tour because uh, you've seen bits and pieces of my room in videos. I did one in the past but I deleted it because I didn't like it and today we're gonna do it again. So welcome to my college apartment room tour. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, so, quick little pan around of the room. Wow, wow, cool, amazing things. All right, door. We've got a Harry Potter poster of, like, the posters from all the different films, and it has, like, all the names in the middle. I got this at the Warner Brothers studio in London. And we've got Yuri on Ice, Victor and Yuri. Got some Undertale posters down there at the bottom. Got some Coco ones, because I stand Coco really hard. And over here we've got Steven and Connie and Stevani, a little Steven Universe thing, and a vintage, truly vintage Dan and Phil Cat Whiskers Come From Within poster. Uh, this is my bathroom door, so we got like a Bohemian Rhapsody Queen poster, got another vintage Dan and Phil cartoony llamas and lions one, got lots of lanyards here on the door, a lot of these are from like convention stuff, so like badges, I got like Harleen and Dexter Morgan and Edward Nygma and Betty Cooper back when I liked Riverdale, and then up here we've got some little Dan and Phil interactive introverts postcards from the DVD. Um, on the top right here, we've got playbills. I have a lot more playbills than this, but they're in boxes. Um, I was, like, really, really into theater in high school. I've done theater basically my whole life, but, like, till the end of high school, like, I don't do it anymore. But I was very into theater and, like, collecting playbills, so, like, most of these I haven't seen. But we've got bandstand previews, Something Rotten, Dear Evan Hansen, Waitress, which is signed by the tour cast, because I saw the tour cast. Uh, Falsetto Land, that's a, that's one of my favorites, because that one's super old. Uh, Cinderella, which I did, in fact, see that show on Broadway. Frozen, Fun Home, which is my favorite show that I've ever seen. I saw it on tour. Uh, Be More Chill, Off-Broadway Revival. Mean Girls, Spongebob, Book of Mormon, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Uh, it's signed there in the corner by Mark Wartella, who was Mike TV, and Hamilton. Got an Umbrella Academy poster. This is one of my most recent additions to my wall because I love the first season of Umbrella Academy so much in the comics. I'm a really big fan of them. Um, then we've got these three from Edward Edward Scissorhands one, Harley and Joker, and the Troublesome Trio, Lock, Shock, and Barrel, which are like my favorite, 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 favorite characters from Nightmare Before Christmas. I love their aesthetic. Um, and then we got some Star Wars ones down there. So we got the, the, like, the greenish one and the reddish one were from Force Awakens. Like, if you saw it, uh, at a certain time period in at AMC or something, and the middle one was from Last Jedi. Then here, my closet door, we've got Stranger Things. We've got lots of Stranger Things stuff on here. So the top one here is like one of my favorites that I have. You can't really see it very well, but there's like a big outline of a Demogorgon. And so then like 11 is being like chained to the ceiling with like Christmas lights. And the boys are trying to save her. And I really like it. I just think it's really like surrealist and cool. Um, then I've got these ones, which my friend got me for Christmas a couple years ago. So it's like the season two poster, this cool art, another season two poster, more cool art. Got that one that I got at a convention, which was like this uh, artist who did a bunch of like fictional location posters. So this one is for Hawkins, Indiana. And then we've got that Demogorgon one at the bottom, which was from the uh, DVD box set from Target. Got a lot more lanyards on here. So like my Dan and Phil, VIP one, uh, Tatnoff, wow, real throwback there. My Playlist Live lanyard from the first Playlist Live, which was, like, signed by everyone I met. More Playlist Live, uh, crew badge for Megacon, which I worked this past year. Here is my closet. It's not very interesting. There's a lot of clothes hanging. There's a lot of t-shirts that are organized by color, because literally all I wear is t-shirts. And we got a little Disney World pennant up there. Got some Gravity Falls postery stuff up there. Got this really cool Stranger Things art that my friend made me for Christmas a few years ago. It's like Terry's little mind thing. So it's breathe, sunflower, the left for the right, full 50 rainbow. I like it a lot. Um, 11, we've got Stranger Things backpack and lots more backpacks. We've got, we've got most of my Monster High dolls. They're all just kind of like stacked on the shelf. I'm sure there are more in a box somewhere, but I used to be a very big Monster High collector. That's what this channel was originally for. So I have them in my closet. Got some more bags, small world, uh, all sorts of stuff. Hats. There's Dustin's hat. More clothes. So interesting. Tons of ears. Those are all like Disney ears that I've made. And then these two in the front are ones that I bought at the parks. 
bunch of random stuff, boring things, lots of jewelry, another monster high doll, all sorts of stuff. Me! Oh, and then I forgot to show in the bathroom, it's a mess, but I got a Dumbledore's Army sign-up sheet, I got some little pumpkin lights because it's Halloween, I got a, a, ser a serious black poster, I've got this little thing of pic Polaroid pictures of me and my friends, and I got this big Harry Potter poster from Chamber of Secrets. It's, just a, it's a lot of Harry Potter happening in my bathroom. On this door, I have like bags and stuff, so like Disney bags, Dan and Phil, more Dan and Phil, more Disney, Harry Potter robe thing, lots of stuff. All right, over to the desk area type of thing. This is one of my favorite things in my room. It is a red balloon lamp. And you got this at Ikea for like $10. So if you're an IT fan and you want one of these, highly recommend going to Ikea. On the string thing, I have like Disney buttons. So like, so like first visit, a celebrating button, my birthday, this like Walt Disney World one, happily ever after buttons, all the sorts of free buttons that you can get at Disney. I got a Star Wars, I got a Galaxy's Edge water bottle and a Stitch thing right there. We got a little pumpkin with a little, with a little fake ghost candle inside because happy heckin' Halloween. We got my MacBook, which has Stranger Things on it, but you've seen that because that laptop is in like all my videos. We've got the Goldfinch. The Goldfinch is on my desk just because we love and support the Goldfinch. Uh, my Wii U. Right here we got the first little column of Funkos. As you're going to see, I have a lot, but they don't all fit on that shelf. So right here we've got Wonder Woman, Bruce Wayne from Gotham, uh, Oswald Cobblepot from Gotham, Harry Potter with uh, Godric Gryffindor's sword, Violet from The Incredibles, and Mickey Mouse. Back there we got a Minnie Mouse popcorn button, got a Cyan Bates Motel script hiding in the back there. This sparkly, like, holographic Steven Universe poster got this poster, which I like a lot. It was from this booth that sold, like, drink adverts, and so get it, because he floats. Um, we got this giant blue diamond poster, because she's my lord and savior and my favorite Steven Universe character. A Jafan poster. Lots of Dan and Phil in my room everywhere. Up here we got this little Sally. Nightmare Before Christmas diorama. Got some 8-bit Stranger Things fam. So Dustin, Lucas, got this little Lego minifigure of, like this custom Lego minifigure of Pennywise. Got Will, my Disney Infinity base that's hooked up to my Wii U there. Mickey and Minnie Zoom Zooms. This is my computer. Wow, it has an it background. Well, actually that's my desktop computer and it hooks up to this monitor so I can basically use this as a TV. Um, then we've got a little Batman and a little Batmobile. Got 11. Got a Polaroid camera. Got a light box, which is also a speaker, and it says ready right now because ready. But there we've got this beautiful creature, which my friend Chloe gave me. Got a little alien from uh, Toy Story. And got this doll, which my grandma made me, and it is the main character from my book, Demon High. So I love her a lot. She sits over my desk and overlooks the things that I do. Go buy my book. Links are always in the description. Back here we've got a hidden... Hidden Bates Motel. You probably won't be able to see it because glare. Hidden Bates Motel drawing print thing. We've got uh, The Shining right there. We got Stranger Things, Stephen Dustin. We've got Queen, Freddie Mercury, Legend. We got this giant Harry Potter, Molly Weasley quote. Lots of random stuff on my desk. Got a little Scoops Ahoy thing, butter beer mug. Got a little Garnet right there. My DS, uh, computer, boring stuff, ponies. Um, right here we got my picture of when I met Dan and Phil, and these are little Halloween Horror Nights, um, tokens, so they say Palace Arcade, you're not gonna be able to see them, but they say Palace Arcade on them because it was a Stranger Things theme, uh, my signed Dan and Phil album that I made, but they signed when I met them. These are little, like, what are these? Oh yeah, they're little, like, phone charms, but it's, uh, Ford from Gravity Falls. Then we've got this, which is probably my favorite Funko item. This little It movie moment of Georgie and Penny in the sewer. Got this cute little Stranger Things diorama. It's kind of hard to see, but the Demogorgon is getting pinned against the wall in the background. Ella's supposed to be facing that way, but I switched her out this way because she's facing, you know, falsetto CD. Lots of other CDs and little Minnie Mouse patches. More CDs. DS games. I got a loser lover yo-yo because that's the kind of person I am. We got Percy Jackson textbooks. Got more fun fandom books. So Life is Strange, Gravity Falls, Batman, Killing Joke, uh, DC Cover Girls, The Stranger Things book, which is still one of my favorite collector's books. It's really, really great. Uh, Hamilton, Harry Potter, Warner Brothers Studio Tour Guide, Harry Potter Film Wizardry, lots of fun stuff. Got my chair right here with my favorite ugly doll and a little Waddles pillow. It's hella cute. Lots of boring stuff under here, um, along with like some 
of those Japanese soda bottles because I hoard them like a weirdo and some books that did not fit on my bookshelf. Wow, more Funkos. We got Batgirl, uh, Hawk Girl, Mr. Freeze, Poison Ivy, Freddie Freeman from Shazam because we stand Jack Dylan Grazer, and Bo Peep. Down here is this random little corner of like this shelf thing with like slippers. So I got like Yuri and Ice Victor slippers, got a Baymax pillow with like Mickey ears, got some blankets, lots of Mickeys over here, Just three Mickeys. So we got Mickey Mouse Club, the like vintage Mickey that looks like Walt's original designs, and then the classic Mickey. Uh, got some little Disney postcards, a Disney scavenger hunt that I did, hidden stuff in the back, you can't see shit. But now going over to the shelf, which is right next to my desk. And on the top is all the plush because I have a problem. So, first of all, at the top, we got Hamilton poster, It Chapter 2 poster, which I got when I went to go see It Chapter 2 on opening day, uh, La La Land poster, Interactive Introverts, Dan and Phil poster, because I have a problem. Over here, we got Mabel there in the back. We got Peridot, R2-D2, Waddles, Harley Quinn, uh, Barb's Dead Corpse, which is my personal favorite plushie. Got a Porg, uh, Pastel Dan and Phil, Dobby, Jordan Peele as a rabbit from Toy Story, Interactive Introverts, Dan and Phil, uh, Jack Skellington, Will, normal Dan and Phil, Spider-Man, Blue Diamond, Dart in his three iterations, and they actually are like nesting dolls, so you can like put them inside each other, it's pretty cool. And then this Mickey apple, cause cute. Funkos, this is my holy grail. I have a Funko problem. So let's look through my Funkos, shall we? Alright, so they're kind of, this shelf is pretty organized. All these other little random Funkos that I have all over the place, not so much. This, I try to keep it organized by like a theme, okay? So this top shelf is the It Funkos. So we've got Georgie, and then we've got the whole Losers Club. So we've got Georgie, Bill, Ben, Bev, Richie, Eddie, Mike, and Stan. Which, by the way, I put these in the order that they're numbered, and I just want to point out how they're numbered, all right? So we've got Bill and Georgie, makes sense. We've got Benverly, we've got Reddy, we've got Stanlin. I don't make the rules. All right, next next shelf is Stranger Things. So we've got Eleven, Mike, Dustin, Lucas, Will, Joyce, Max, and Punk Eleven over there in the corner. Down one more, this is like a generic horror shelf. So we've got the three Shining Pops, which are actually like my favorite, favorite Funkos that I have. I'm gonna kneel down here so you can kind of see, which you won't be able to, but there's like a blood splatters on the box and they say Red Room. Um, so yeah, I have all three of them. I don't have the twins, but the twins are like, very hard to find. So we got Jack Torrance, Wendy Torrance, Danny Torrance. Got Gage and Church from Pet Cemetery. We got Pennywise. We've got Spider Pennywise. We've got 1990 Pennywise. And we've got Norman Bates over there hiding in the dark. Down here is like my cartoons shelf. So, we, so we've got Dipper and Mabel from Gravity Falls. We've got Mabel in her unicorn sweater. We've got Waddles and then Steven Universe one. So we've got Steven, Garnet, Stevani, and Pink Diamond. I have two Garnets. So that Garnet goes over there. Then we've got this random shelf of more Stranger Things and some other stuff. So we've got Snowball, Eleven, and Mike. We've got Season 3, Eleven, and Mike. We've got Eleven in her Benny's Burgers outfit. Season 2, Eleven. Sabrina from Chilling Adventures of Sabrina and Jughead from Riverdale in, like, his comic costume. And then down here, these two bottom shelves are Harley and Joker, respectively. So we've got Batman the Animated Series Harley, Pink Harley, Original Harley, uh, Mohawk Harley, Bombshells Harley, Suicide Squad Harley, Comic Red and Blue Harley, and Arkham City. Arkham Knight? Arkham Knight Harley. I had a goal originally, which was to get all of the Harley Quinns, and they just keep coming out with more, and I haven't been able to keep up. So for now, these are most of them. I have some more. We're gonna continue. We've got Batman the Animated Series Joker, Martha Wayne Joker, Bombshells Joker, uh, Arkham Asylum Joker, Suicide Squad two different Suicide Squad Jokers. That's like the shirtless one and that's the one with the suit. Uh, and then we got two more Harley Quinn. So we got the Batgirl dressed as Harley Quinn and the Arkham Asylum Harley Quinn. Fun times. Wow. That's the whole Funko shelf. Don't worry, there are more. <laughs> We've got uh, the Shining poster, because in case you, I haven't mentioned, it's my favorite film of all time. Then we've got a Stranger Things season two uh, poster, which came with the vinyl. We got this little fake like photo strip of Victor and Yuri from Yuri on Ice, because we stan. Wow, that's much better. Okay, look at that. There's this little Minnie Mouse, like, kitchen sink thing from, like, a Sunday that I got at the park, which has hand sanitizers in it and stuff. Uh, you can't really see it, but there's a pride 
Mean Girls Playbill back there. Mickey Mouse Tissue Box. Wow, a little pig that holds all my styluses. Wow, we've got a Stranger Things Season 3 poster from the vinyl. We've got this thing. I don't know, it's kind of cute. Um, a little R2-D2 candy, because I have candy everywhere. There was, there was a bunch of candy back there. I don't know if I showed that. But, um, a candle, a Vinylmation Mickey, a little egg Mickey, a chocolate frog box, a little water dispenser so I can fill up my water in the middle of the night and not die of thirst. Another little ghost candle. We've got some Stranger Things coasters. So we got a Benny's Burgers one. We got a Mornings Are for Coffee and Contemplation one. For my Dole Whip water cup. Another Disney thing. Wow. Can you tell that I live in Orlando and I go to Disney a lot? Um, so then we got my Losers Club notebook, which is for like a lot of different stuff. Um, Dr. Sleep. I'm reading that right now. Also reading like three other books, but these are the only two that are on my bedside table right now. Um, down here underneath, we got a bunch of boring stuff in between there. Got my R plus E tissue box. Um, this is a Stranger Things box. What's in here? Oh, Legos. Extra Lego pieces. More Funkos. These are just kind of like the rejects that didn't fit anywhere else. So, Frankie Stein, a little Monster High one that my friend got me because I used to be really into Monster High. Uh, Peter Parker from Spider-Man Homecoming and Enchantress from Suicide Squad. Right there, we got some pictures of me and my friends, which you can't see because of the light. Uh, then we got the three, the big three, which you can see in like all my recent videos. So, Call Me By Your Name, Stranger Things, and It. I actually want to replace this one, gasp, shocker, with a Goldfinch poster. So I'm working on getting a Goldfinch one. I have to get the exact size so it'll match. Um, then we've got the little Stranger Things behind the scenes photo from the DVD set. They're all over there. It's hella cute. Then we've got my bed, which is actually made for ones. Cause so you can see, this bed is a pain in the ass to make because of the way that like all the pillows go and how it's like against the wall. So I never make it for videos. Sorry, you can see it now. So it's got Christmas lights all around the bottom because it's a Stranger Things bed. Um, this duvet is, was from Target from like two years ago and I'm pretty sure they don't sell it anymore because now they just sell all the season three stuff and this was like before season two came out but it's like the right side up gray with like the kids and then Will's down there and the Demogorgon. It's really cool. Like I like how it's like doesn't scream Stranger Things. Like I feel like it's simple enough and I like how it's like gray scale and stuff. I don't know and then yeah I got the matching sheets so the pillowcases have the alphabet and the run on it and then like the actual sheets are the alphabet. It's cute. Oh, and then there are these pillows in the back which match this. Also got these little dude bros on the bed frame, the little clips. We got Mabel and Joker and Victor and Harley Quinn. And we've got these bros. So we got my Kylo Ren Build-A-Bear, which is like my favorite thing ever. Uh, Tiny Penny 11. Giant Mickey Mouse, because he has nowhere else to possibly go. Um, then I got a light back there, which has a little Halloween lantern on it. Um, got a canopy with the Mind Flayer on top, because I don't know. It's kind of funny. Halloween garland, because it's Halloween. That's not normally there. And we got some ears. So I, I have more than this, clearly, because you saw my closet, but these are the only ones that I have on the wall. So I have like the original mini, millennial pink, the classic blue mini, the Sally ones, and rose gold. Here's my window. Wow, there are a bunch of butterflies on it, like fake blue butterflies that were from my Max Life is Strange cosplay from a couple years ago. Got more spooky Halloween decorations. It's like the sticky window things that say help, and it's like in blood. I don't know, it's kind of funny. Got my school backpack, wow. Also, there's a Call Me By Your Name poster right up there above the uh, window. Then, the elusive Lego Stranger Things set. I have a whole video of me building this and talking about season four theories. If you want to go watch that, it was a catastrophe. It kept falling apart, but it looks cute now, you know? And I got the bike piece. I had to order one from Lego's website because it was, in fact, not in my set. But it's here now, and it's cute, and we love it. So here's what this wall is. This wall is covered in like postcards and I'm kind of regretting it now because now I'm going to need to start stacking Funkos up this wall and covering them, but it's fine. So it's mostly Steven Universe because I got like a book of Steven Universe postcards, but then we've got like a Harry Potter one there. This is one of my favorite art pieces that I've ever gotten at a convention. It's Harley Quinn Pennywise. It's kind of amazing. Um, got Simon and Baz right there from a Carry On, Harry Potter right there, Victor and Yuri, Gravity Falls, more Harry Potter, Steve, Steve Harrington, uh, Harry Potter. There's an 11 right there. 
And yeah, then we got uh, Whale's drawing, Whale's missing poster, Richie's missing poster, my favorite piece of art that I've ever gotten to convention. It's not that one. That's my second favorite. This is actually my favorite, and it's being covered by these guys, so I'm moving it. It's Gravity Falls Stranger Things. So it's Stranger Things in the Gravity Falls art style, and I freaking love it. You can't really see it because of the glare, but look, look, Will's right there in the corner, and like Bill is in the background. It's fantastic. Okay, so actual shelf. We've got this box, which is what that vintage Mickey and Minnie were in. Um, it's kind of cool, so I like put Funkos in it, just random Funkos. So we got the New York Comic Con, Jack Skellington. We've got a Harley Quinn roller derby, like one that's signed by the comic artist. You can't see it because glare, and I don't want to open it because it's going to mess everything up. We've got Dwala Dent, Bombshells one, and Coraline right there. We got this two pack of Harley and Joker. Got this little Vinylmation two pack of Dipper and Mabel, which I love a lot. Um, little frings of little Polaroids of me and my friends. Wow. Um, a, a Galaxy's Edge Star Wars Coca-Cola because the Disney Star Wars park has like fancy alien sodas and I bought one and I like it a lot. We got that Loser Lover painting that my friend made me for my birthday a couple years ago and I love it very dearly. Got a Golden Snitch, a uh, Luna Lovegood's Wand, Birdie Bots Every Flavor Beans box, Got a little chip zoom zoom. Got more Funkos. Wow, this is the last of them. We got Tamaki from Moral High School Host Club. We got two Victors from Miriam Nice, so Normal Victor and Young Victor. And then we got uh, Ray and Kylo Ren because Raylo. And a Time Turner. Then we got these little, uh, what are these? The vinyls, like the Funko vinyls. Uh, it's Barb and Eleven. Um, then we got, you can't see the other one. It actually might have fallen behind the dresser, which is tragic, but my Dan and Phil, uh, tickets right here. Then we got the mini. I actually really like how she looks here. Not gonna lie, but I'm gonna have to move her soon if I get more Funkos, which I will. Then we got the Stranger Things walkie talkie, which is actually like a box for like a puzzle. Uh, this little Mike and Eleven vinyl thing. I know to picture me and my friends. Then we got that Henry Selleck Leica poster, which I like a lot. So the guy who everyone thinks is Tim Burton and isn't, um, Henry Selleck, he did all of those movies, like Coraline and stuff. Yay. Then we got Ruby and Sapphire here. Uh, my Stranger Things calendar. Is it on the right month? Yes, it is. October. We got Ghostbusters. Got my ukulele, which is I painted to look like Stevens from Steven Universe. Got a little Mickey Mouse sipper cup. See, it has like a straw. This is actually a cup. I got it at Disney. And he holds my magic band. And he's standing on uh, the com Incomplete History of Secret Organizations, which is the Series of Unfortunate Events book. Because I love Series of Unfortunate Events. I have a Series of Unfortunate Events tattoo. I am a part of VFD. Um, record player file cabinet. And then right here on the edge of my bed, I have these headphones. Got a case for my Polaroid. And got like more lanyards. This is my Disney one with all my pins for trading and stuff, and it's got my annual pass in here. And then I got this Epcot lanyard, which you can't see because Epcot is being covered. And then here is my Harry Potter Universal one. So it's got Gryffindor, which I am a Gryffindor, in case you were wondering. Platform nine and three quarters, more Gryffindor, Hogwarts Express, fun times. Let's look at the actual shelf. Wow, back over here. We've got lots of Harry Potter books. Uh, both of the Stranger Things DVD sets that like, look like VHS tapes. They're really cool, and I'm not going to be able to put that back now. Cool! Um, Gravity Falls DVDs, lots of Gravity Falls books. Uh, Dan and Phil stuff, Umbrella Academy, more comics and graphic novels and things. This is a bunch of random books. Wow, look at that! Oh, oh my god, what are these? Who wrote this? Oh my god, me? Wow, ignore that really annoying line right there. Go buy it in all the book places. Link is always in the buy. Whoa, what's that? Is that also me? Wow, look at that. Go read it. <laughs> more books. John Green. Uh, there's, I'm missing a couple in here, so it looks kind of empty and it's bothering me. Look what just came in the mail. We're gonna read this for a video. Rainbow Rowell, Becky Albertalli, my faves. This entire shelf is Rick Riordan. So we've got Percy Jackson, Heroes of Olympus, uh, Apollo, Magnus, Kane Chronicles, all the things. Uh, this Divergent book is, is a placeholder because my, my roommate is borrowing my It book. So just pretend that's, an, that's my It book. Got another it book. Uh, this is all the Stephen King stuff, clearly. Pet Cemetery, Shining, his on writing book. Two copies of The Goldfinch, because I finally got a second copy of The Goldfinch so I could highlight all my favorite quotes. Lots more books. Fun times. Down here, this is a random shelf of like 
figures and collectibles and stuff. So these are all Disney Infinity figures because I used to be really into Disney Infinity. And then the back is just a bunch of random stuff. So I got like E.T. and My Little Pony and Venture Time and that Joker piggy bank. Lots of stuff. Storage boxes, which hold lots of things. Binders, which hold more things. Records, wow, let's do a quick little record tour of my faves. So we got Bohemian Rhapsody, we got Calling By Your Name, which is peach colored and peach scented. It's the most iconic thing I own. Stranger Things 3, Stranger Things 2. Melanie Martinez Crybaby, I saw her in concert last night. I'm never gonna be over it. This random one I got at Urban Outfitters, which has Billie Eilish on it, and it cost me like four bucks, so I bought it. Pray for the Wicked, because Brendan Urie is an icon. Love, Simon. Wow. Mean Girls, the musical. This vinyl is also pink, and I love it. Lots more old ones, which I took from my parents, because that was my dad's old record player, and he doesn't use it anymore, so I took all the records. And then we've got this little Lego shelf, which you can't see anything because it's dark, but there are Legos here. We've got cars and minifigures and a little Fantastic Beast set and Jokers in the back. Lots of stuff is happening here. Lots of Legos. And then last but not least, the last thing in my room is this beautiful Pennywise poster. It looks like a Looney Tunes opener and I like it a lot. That is my room! I feel like it took a really long time, even though it literally didn't. But thanks for watching! You finally got to see my room! Yay! And hopefully I actually like this when I edit it together because my last one I didn't. But yeah, thanks for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, follow me on Instagram. Press the notification bell because I have no uploading schedule, so if you want to know when I upload a video, that's your best way to go. Or follow me on Instagram because I always post something on my story there when I post a new video. Uh, comment on here and on Instagram. I answer all my comments because I like talking to you guys. And yeah, thanks for watching, thanks for looking at my room.